resentment gets settled. And one thing means everything. Win, 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 win. everything else. Win, 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 win. Welcome to Spartan Stadium. And we've got one of the hottest games of the week for you here on Fox as the sixth ranked Michigan Wolverines come into town to take on the 24th ranked Spartans of Michigan State. Spartans get it off, Lewerke with time, and incomplete. Felton Davis, the intended receiver, and he got decked. Josh Metellus delivering the wood. And Metellus, while it looks severe, I mean, an incredible job of keeping his head down to the side, not leading with the crown, and not contacting Felton Davis in the head or neck area. That's a textbook hit. That is exactly what they're trying to get these players to do. Head to the side. Michigan State. Opening series for the Spartans. Lewerke. Looking. Lewerke. Scrambling, and he's sacked. Terrific job by Joshua Uche. Tell you what, Uche is just motor time. Watch as he's trying to beat Cole Chewins, the left tackle, and he just keeps going, keeps going. Now he's going to continue on that route. Lorke didn't have anywhere to go. First and 10 at the 16 yard line for the Wolverines. Patterson drops it off in the flats. Chris Evans with the catch. Nice juke. It'll gain eight, maybe nine yards on the play. And that Paul Bunyan trophy, it's four foot. A four footer wooden statue was donated by the governor, G. Menon Williams, to mark Michigan State's acceptance into the Big Ten back in 1953. Second down and one at the 25. Mason, Chris Evans, line up in a tight eye formation. McCune in motion. They hand it off to the up back, Ben Mason, and he picks up the first down. And then obviously at the quarterback position. Perron Higdon checks back in first and 10 at the 27. Play fake. Patterson rolls out, drops it off. This ball caught by his tight end, Sean McCune. Hume picks up positive yards, and when you look at Jim Harbaugh teams, back out to Spartan Stadium. All right, we're ready to resume play after a one hour and 15 minute weather delay. Michigan will be faced with a second and six at the 45 yard line. Gerard Higdon is the tailback. And Higdon stood up and tackled for a loss at the 40. Ray Quan Williams, the junior from Chicago, with the tackle. Patterson with time all day. And that one broken up, or is it? And they're going to give it a catch wow. to Nico Collins. Wow, what an adjustment Collins makes. Collins is on his route. Watch as he's kind of slips right there. Remember, we had all the rain, and then all of a sudden he goes all the way back for the ball, wrestles it away from David Dow, the safety. He's a big guy that can really sink his hips and change directions. Patterson, deep drop, steps up, steps up, delivers. Caught on the sideline. Nick Eubanks, the tight end. Higdon cuts it inside with running room. And Karan Higdon will gain six yards. Patterson to Higdon again, turns the corner, squares his shoulders, dives. And he's close to the first down, Bocci. Third down one at the Michigan State 13 for the Wolverines. Higdon, first down. That started at the Michigan 16. First down and 10 at the Spartan 11. Higdon again running the football. Four times on this series. 
Second and seven at the eight. Patterson. This time it's Evans. The lead forward gain a couple. For Patterson. Remember, he can run. Patterson to throw it. Looking inside. Touchdown, Wolverines. Nico Collins. And that's the first passing touchdown for Michigan against Michigan State since 2011. Ooh, what a series there. It began with the run game coming out of the locker room. And it's good. The Wolverines go 14 plays covering 84 yards. And look at the time of possession, seven minutes and 56 seconds. First, I want you to check out Shea Patterson as he puts his eyes over to the left side of the field. And that's going to open up just enough space. And then, as you see at the back end right here, now his eyes are going to go back to this side of the field. He sees that he's got space with Nico Collins, the big wide receiver, and he goes right up to his face, Max. What do you do with a 6'4", 218-pound guy? Let him go upstairs and win over the top. Jim Harbaugh loves it, as he should. Shea Patterson, great play. 11th passing touchdown of the season for Patterson. And Michigan takes a 7 0 lead. The Greens are back on offense. First down at the 42. Higdon. Hit. Higdon breaks free. Higdon still on the move. Picks up a first down. Gets down the sideline. Burst of speed. Cuts it inside and he's down. Inside the Michigan State 20. That's a gain of 38 yards. Joe Bocci with the tackle. And at three at the 13. Michigan 0 for their last three on third down conversion. Here's Patterson rolling. Patterson. And he'll be sacked. Andrew Dow. He was three for five against Wisconsin last week. Missed from 54 and 41. Oh, my goodness. Heck of a job by this defense. Obviously helped out by Nordine, who just absolutely hooks it. The duck hook knuckleball having a hard enough time making first downs, much less is 15. Here's the work he sprints out of the pocket, looks, delivers, and caught for first down. Get some rhythm in the offense. Ooh, I don't know. The work he gets the snap off, throws to the sideline. No flag on the play. Felton Davis, the intended receiver, looks like he was held. Lewerke serving and he's sacked. Second sack of the day, Uche. He's got two. Joshua Uche, the junior from Miami. Thank you. Third down and 14 at the 26. Lewerke rolls out. Sets, throws. Oh, almost intercepted. Ron Higdon in the backfield. Almost begging for the football. He'll get it. Wow. What a play. Blown up in the backfield. Patterson will hand it off to Evans, and he swore a fumble. Spartans have it. First turnover of the game. Michigan State has it deep in Michigan territory. I think it was Raquan Williams. They pitch it. The reverse. The work he's open. Touchdown, Spartans. Down Stewart. Mark D'Antonio pulling out another wrinkle. And we're level at seven. Michigan State forces the turnover. Michigan over their last six on third down conversion. Patterson over the middle. Almost intercepted. 
Kari Willis had it. And the Wolverines will punt it. Totally out of sorts, this Michigan offense. Patterson thinks that Grant Perry is going to break inside. He goes outside, and Patterson almost puts it right in the lap, basically does, of Kari Willis, who almost comes up with interception. In fact, Perry just has to knock it out and play defense there with his left hand. Hart punting for the sixth time. Shakur Brown back at his own 40. Rain coming down in buckets now. Hart sends it away. And Brown picks it up. Brown gets outside and lost it. Michigan has it now. And there's a flag. The ruling on the field, it's a fumble. And the Spartans cough it up to the Wolverines. Higdon with five straight 100-yard games. Second and two, the 22. And they fumble! Michigan State's got the football! Unbelievable! Miscues by the Wolverines. First down for Lewerke and the Spartans. Scott. And Winovich just wraps him up. Another tackle for a loss. Big time player right here, Chase Winovich. No doubt. And ball security is becoming so important. All three fumbles in this game, two by Michigan, one by Michigan State, have happened in the last six minutes since this rain started to come down. And you've got to be secure. I would take your gloves off. The gloves nowadays are not good in the wet weather. Your bare hands are much better. So most of these guys will go without gloves, especially if you're handling the football. No question. Second down and 11 of the 22 underneath incomplete. Stewart. The factor, 20 to 25 mile per hour wins right now. Michigan State 0 for 7 on third down conversions. The worky looking. The worky. And he'll just fall down at the line of scrimmage. And the Spartans will punt it away. So in a game like this, Joel, you grew up in Colorado, so snow's there all the time. Yep. You played at the University of Colorado. There's snow. Spartans with it at midfield. First down. L.J. Scott. And L.J. Scott met at the line of scrimmage and knocked backwards. Quiddy Pay for Michigan State. First down and 25 to the 35. Lewerke. Over the middle, and complete Sowers in the third. The worky over the middle again, and it's Sowers making the grab in front of Metellus. Trying to get a conversion, you still got to be careful with the football, knowing a punt is still a good play. Third and 17. Here's the worky, and he'll deliver incomplete. Had all sorts of white jerseys in his face. Sokol, the intended receiver, so Michigan State will punt it again. And one of those white jerseys was number 15, Chase Winovich. Right now, and potentially put a series together to put some points on the board. First down and 10 of the 21 for Michigan. Patterson. Winding up. He's got a receiver. Peoples Jones down the sideline. tell you earlier give these guys a chance I believe the best players on this offense are standing at the wide receiver position with Nico Collins and Donovan Peoples Jones and it's good 224 to go in the third quarter 14 to 7 Michigan but this one just getting started from East Lansing back after this You never know. First down and 10 for Lewerke. And the Spartans at their own 25. Here's Lewerke. Delivers. And incomplete. Looking for Hayward. Michigan State getting a rate away from the run right now. Here's Lewerke. Looks backside. Incomplete again. 
Stewart, the intended receiver. Oh, and he was open, and he knows it. Stewart knows it. For nine on third down conversion. Lewerke looking. And another incomplete pass. Cam Chambers, the intended receiver. Nobody open, Joel. Jones and Nico Collins to make a play on the outside. Second and 10 of the 16. Patterson. Now he'll dance. Looking. Throws. Oh, God! What a catch by Zach Gentry! Well, I don't know. I think Gentry was out of bounds, came back inbounds as then. But he wouldn't have been the first to touch it. He did have no hat. The officials got no hat, which means Gentry was out of bounds at some point. So now they're going to talk about whether he was one forced out and, and secondly, whether he was the first to touch the ball. There's no foul for legal touching. The ball was tipped. First down, Michigan. So Gentry definitely was out of bounds. The hat comes off, but remember, that was intended for Nico Collins, and then when it was batted up into the air, or excuse me, Donovan Peoples-Jones, throwing a little bit behind him. I mean, so fortunate that that wasn't picked off by Joe Bocci Jr., and then Gentry, right place, right time, and he's right there to go ahead and make the catch. That left foot was establishing him back in the field of play before he touched that ball, so that's why it's a legal catch. A 16-yard gain, first down at the 32. Second time Michigan has benefited from that kind of tipped ball and reception is Higdon, second and five to the 37. Higdon, following his blocks, picks up a first down and more secures the football as he gets inside Michigan State territory. Michigan State's hands and how they want to play defense. Perry and Peoples-Jones line up on the far side of the field. Perry has found soft spots in that Michigan State defense. Third and ten at the 49. They throw it far side. Collins. And Collins short of the first down. Ooh, you know, with the way that defense is playing, he might have created a short enough fourth down opportunity where Jim Harbaugh will think about going for it, and he will. Here come the big fellas. Ben Mason, the power back in the backfield. Patterson keeps it, picks up the first down, hits the sideline, covers himself up, and is down to the Michigan State 30. An 11-yard gain, Shakir Brown with the tackle. What a great read from Patterson. Watch as his eyes are going to go all over the defensive end. Bang. Willikis is down low, and now Patterson's going to find himself all the way on the edge with a great read, exactly like last week against Wisconsin. When they needed a big play, it was Patterson's legs that delivered. That's the seventh time that Patterson has converted a third down with his feet this season. Partner, that was actually a fourth down. First and ten at the 30. Handoff, Higdon. Higdon still moving. Power running. Karan Higdon. I always just think it's all everything's third down. Hundred yard game. Second and one at the 21. Higdon again. And a first down. Lucas with the tackle. And there is a flag on the play. More flags. Michigan just cannot control themselves right now. Both teams have been chippy. These flags and shoving ensued. After the play, there's unsportsmanlike conduct penalties on both teams. On the offense, number 50. On the defense, those fouls offset. They are the first of, of the game for each player. I want you to watch number 96 for Michigan State. Okay, here he is. He's pushing 51. Watch this. He clearly over, and now he's just bending him back, bending him back, bending him back, and now 50. Awainu comes on. He's like, hey, get off of my guy. 
He shoves him back. Runyon even throws him down. So Jacob Ponishu got away with a little bit of a cheap play. And Jim Harbaugh urging his team, think, be smart. We've got the lead. We're driving in the fourth quarter. First down and 10 at the Michigan State 18-yard line for the Wolverines. Karan Higdon, over 100 yards rushing today. Higdon, no, it's Patterson on the fake. Patterson down inside the 10-yard line. An 11-yard gain. He pulled it out at the last moment. His ball handling has been tremendous. Watch this fake. Great look right here. He's looking right at Kenny Willekes, and he looks down the line of scrimmage as if, oh, yeah, I'm giving it down there, and then boom, he's out to the left and uses some of that speed. It's been a while since Michigan fans had this amount of belief in the potential of their team, but they've got to convert here. Second and goal of the five. McHugh, the motion man. They hand it off. Mason, touchdown, Wolverines. Ben Mason. And Michigan with a chance to take a 21-7 lead. What a drive. Into players, offense. We've got this mash down, and then this tackle's going to get up. Bushel Beatty, bang, he's going to get the linebacker. And now it's hats on hats, and Mason finds the seam, leaps over a little bit and finds himself in the end zone. What a great drive for Michigan right there. A huge drive with the way that defense is playing. And the kick is good. 13-play drive covering 84 yards. Wolverines eat up six minutes and 41 seconds. Ben Mason pays it off with the touchdown run. 21 to seven. Wolverines on top of the Spartans. It's Ohio. If Michigan can get there in the top 10 with only one loss. Third down and one. Higdon looking for the first down. Has it. Brady Quinn and Notre Dame fighting Irish back in 2006 in South Bend. So it's been a minute. Face with the third down and five now at the 42. Higdon. And it'll be close to the first down. Needed to get the 42 fully in order to move the chains, and it looks like he did it, and they'll give him the first down. Lefe, Lombardi rolls out of the pocket. And that ball is caught by Daryl Stewart. Play in the element, second and one at the 24. Hale coming down now. And Lombardi is roughed up and slammed. The pile drive by Devin Bush. Well, they brought the house there. Lombardi didn't recognize it, didn't get the ball out of his hand quickly, and now the clock continues to run. Bush was unblocked all the way in Lombardi's face. Third down at 13. Lombardi steps up, sacked again. This time it's Michael Dwumfour. And that brings up fourth down and 13. Just beat him on the outside. Dwumfour at the defensive tackle position. Just a little outside move. Gets back to the quarterback and in Lombardi's lap. And in two snaps of the football, this Michigan defense flexing some muscle. Fourth down and 17 for the Spartans. Lombardi under pressure and incomplete. Michigan State will turn it over on downs with a minute and 12 remaining. And now the Wolverines can start their celebration. Seven straight wins. The experiment continues to work. For Jim Harbaugh and the Michigan Wolverines.
Shea Patterson turning out to be a terrific leader for this university. Final play of the game and it's over. 21 to 7 Michigan comes to East Lansing and defeats the Spartans. The Paul Bunyan Trophy will head to Ann Arbor. Final score, 21 to seven, Michigan defeats Michigan State. Join us after the break for Colorado and Washington.